Today, I'm going to bring you guys two setups that are absolutely going to shred zone coverage at every level of the field. And both these setups are going to complement each other so well. So we are going to be continuing my pro style offensive scheme out of the Tampa Bay Buccaneers playbook. And then the formation we are in today for both setups is tight double. The first play we're going to go over is mesh spot. And then the second setup is going to be curl. Now these plays work so well off of each other because they are going to be using the exact same motion across the field, but they're going to attack zone coverage in completely different ways. Now, this is going to really keep the defense guessing and make it really tough for them to gauge where we are going to go with the football. Now, mesh spot is going to be a great play to get it into a playmaker's hands very quickly, let him make a play up the field, and then if they start playing underneath, guys, we have multiple vertical routes really attacking deeper down the field. And then curls, guys, is one of my go-to third down plays for this scheme. It really just has so many routes attacking soft spots and zone coverage. If the user starts aggressive trying to take those away we have a post that we can fire in over the middle all right let's look at mesh spot first all right guys so for mesh spot we always want the running back to the wide side of the field then we want to take the outside receiver on the short side of the field we want to put him on a streak route and motion him across the field it's really just going to be a clear out route for us then we want to take the outside receiver on the wide side of the field and we just want to smart route this player now we only want to do this if it's like first and ten second and eight if it's like second and five third and five you can just leave him on his stock route all right let's get into the gameplay and reads for this play okay guys so adjustments on the field motion this player across put him on a streak and you can see we smart routed this player we see he's getting way deeper down the field now our first read guys is going to be this running back out of the backfield you look this is a super unique route combo i've never seen anyone running anything like this so you're just going to wait. You're going to look to the running back right away, guys. And we're going to look for the flat defenders right away. So as soon as we see the flat defenders, we right here, this is the flat defender coming down. So if he's starting at depth or if he starts to back up right away, basically, if they're not in a hard flat, we want to throw this running back route right away. He's going to get inside of this flat defender right like that. Rack catch it, get up field, juke a guy out, make a guy miss, and we are gone up the sideline for like a 60-yard touchdown. Cover three, guys. If they're not playing hard flats on the field, this route is going to get open basically every time. The only thing is that against cover two, we have to be careful. If they have a hook curl lined up over this player in cover two, and he's sitting there, do not throw this ball. So this is a two-deep shell, but we snap the ball. And they have no hook curl getting out right over top. They have no flat defender coming down. So once again, fire that ball in, make a guy miss, get up field, and that's a really easy game. Okay, same thing, guys. Motion this player out. Now I want to look at the down and distance. So this is second and 10, 17 seconds left in the half. So our second route, guys, if we get this wheel route taken away. So they have a hard flat here. But this was even more, I just wanted to really push this down the field. So seven seconds left, guys. We have this corner route backside. So if I don't like this front side look, if the user jumps over there or they have a hard flat on the field taking that away, our, our eyes are going to go to this backside corner route, guys. Look at the flat defender here. He's dropping 15, 20 yards back. And they have a deep blue defender here, guys. He gets totally turned around. You're going to see this a ton. He gets in behind the flat defender and you can fire in this corner route. So that's always going to be our second read, guys. If that deep blue defender doesn't bite down and sit really hard on that corner route, we are going to fire that in there. Okay, right here, guys, let's fire this off again. So right here, we snap the ball and we see we've ran this play a few times. The user is jumping down right away. So then we're going to look to the corner route. We see deep blue defender. Honestly, we could have fired that in you can see it's getting wide open. But when I see the user leave the middle of the field like that, guys, we have this smart routed hook that is just wide open. So these are two vertical routes going down the field and you can basically pick one if the user leaves the middle of the field, guys. Here that deep hook is absolutely wide open and we can fire that in for an easy game. All right, and then our last read is gonna be this drag. So this is just gonna be a nice check down option if everything's taken away. So we snap the ball here. And if I ever see the user just play playing over the running back right pre-snap then I'm gonna come off of that because you never know that can just be a risky throw he can come down and, and take that away so then we're gonna look everyone is dropping back so this this defender here is getting way under our corner route this defender here is getting underneath our deep curl route coming in the middle of the field so if everyone's dropping back just fire this drag in underneath guys just like that get up field and we're able to pick up 11 yards if you like what you are seeing so far definitely leave a like down below it really 
really just helps the algorithm helps me get my name out there and then if you guys want to see everything that's out for this scheme so far check the link in the description i'll link the playlist down below and then if you guys want to see even more setups for this scheme even more deep dives into this scheme and all my other past schemes and the defense i'm running right now click the join button down below join my channel membership and you will get access to even more great content all right guys so for curl same thing we want the running back to the wide side of the field then we're going to take that same receiver guys that outside receiver on the short side of the field and we're just going to motion him across the field and then we want to take the inside receiver on the short side of the field and we just want to put him on a hitch this is going to be just another check down route for us all right let's look at the reads and gameplay for this play all right so we motion this corner route across the field he turns into a post and you just see how many great zone beaters there are on the field right here this is just such a killer play to pair with mesh spot so our first read on this play is always going to be this table route out of the backfield so as soon as we snap the ball we're just going to look to this side of the field and if there's no hard flat firing down on this player guys you just want to fire it out there get the rock in his hands make a guy miss get up field okay same thing motion out we're gonna look to the wide side of the field and if the wide side of the field here we see this player firing down guys so as soon as we see that our eyes are gonna come off then we're gonna look we have a hook here we have a backside hook and we have a, this drag coming across the field there is so many routes that are gonna help take this user the user sees this hook wide open guys he's gonna come to it he sees this drag wide open he's gonna come to it so then we we have this post coming in backside he's doing a great job of getting in front of those deep blue defenders and just getting to this great soft spot and then we can just fire that in for a super easy completion okay here we go again look to the running back out of the backfield here we go so we see hard flat getting underneath we see user playing underneath there taking these two players away he has another yellow zone dropping back now so okay now we're gonna look to this hook route guys and this hook route is absolutely killer against zone coverage so basically how this route is gonna work if they have their zone drop set if they're double flatting so they have a hard flat here taking this player away what they're gonna do they're gonna have their second flat descender set at 15 to 25 yards so this other hook guys is just gonna sit in between those two zones you can just fire that in sitting right there for another super easy game all right and then this last one i really like guys because we have that same motion across we had run that mesh spot play with our wheel coming out of the backfield a few times so watch their user on this play guys he's like oh crap he sees a running back going up field he thinks he's gonna run that wheel up the field so he gets underneath that running back he's playing the wheel so i'm gonna come off of that then we look backside guys we could have had this post absolutely wide open in the middle of the field but we see this player running with the drag so then we have this other hook in behind so that's kind of our last read guys if you don't like everything else you can just pick whatever's open between this drag and this hook backside fire that in get up field for another super easy game now if you want to see a breakdown on why i think this scheme is going to be so tough to stop and the personnel and abilities we use for it click this video right here